Hey guys, welcome to Psychonauts. Um, this game is pretty old. It was made in 20, no, yeah, 2005 actually. So, I have played this game before. I played it like yesterday, and I recorded it yesterday. But the resolution was too low, so it turned out bad, so I'm gonna have to start over again. Go to save game to continue. Alright, new game. The human Pets. mind. 600 miles of synaptic fiber, five and a half ounces of cranial fluid, 1500 grams of complex neural matter. A three-pound pile of dreams. But I'll tell you what it really is. It is the ultimate battlefield. And the ultimate weapon. The wars of this modern age, the psychic age, are all fought somewhere between these damp, curvaceous undulations. From this day forward, you are all psychic soldiers. Paranormal paratroopers! Mental marines who are about to ship out on the adventure of their lives! This is our beachhead! And this is your landing craft! You shall engage the enemy in his own mentality! You shall chase his dreams! You shall fight his demons! You shall live his nightmares! And those of you who fight well, you will find yourselves on the path to becoming international secret agents. In other words, psychonauts! The rest of you will die! <laughs> Terrified kids. <laughs> Crying kid. Oh, Maury. Children, you are not going to die. Well, if you're not a psychonaut, then you might as well be dead. They told me this was a summer camp. Ah, <laughs> oh, Dogen. Don't worry about old Coach Oleander. I've been coming here for years, and trust me, nothing ever happens. Yeah, Dogen. Lily's right. You don't got nothing to worry about. Except for that giant monster in the <gasps> lake I was telling you about. Bobby Zilch! I told you to stop scaring people Bobby. with that ridiculous old legend. I don't want the kids to be afraid to go out at night and walk alone on the perfectly safe this is our main of character. Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp. And we don't want to scare our special guests, Superstar Psychonauts Sasha Nine and Mia Vodello. Panicking kids. Formation. It's resisting. Quick, bring it over here. What is it? It's just a little boy. What's your name, darling? I'll find out. Cut! My name is Roz. Is Rasputin. <coughs> is Roz. Everybody calls me Raz. No, Roz. Don't kill us, Lake Monster. Compelling. <coughs> Armored like a tank. Sorry I'm late. I don't want to disrupt your briefing, Agent Oleander. Agents 9, Vodello. Please, continue. Where do you think you're going? You've broken into a highly classified remote government training facility. I know. Isn't it great? L listen, why don't I just sit over here quietly with my fellow psychedets? Hey, how's it going? I like your hat. We need to have this young man taken from here immediately. I'll call his parents. What? But 
Don't you train psychonauts here? Yes, darling, but... To soar across the astral plane. To wage psychic warfare against the enemies of free thought. That is what I wrote on the front of the pamphlet. Those words are why I'm here, Coach Oleander. Do you remember what you wrote on the inside of that pamphlet? You were born with a special gift. But the people around you treat it like a curse. Your mother is afraid of you. And your father looks at you with shame in his eyes. Come to Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp, and you can show them all. Back home, your powers make you a loner, an outcast, a circus freak. But in this dojo, in this psychic dojo, they make you a hero. Christ. Get that soldier a bunk. Now, darling, you can stay here for a few days until your parents come for you. But we can't let you participate in any paranormal training without your parents' consent. I'm sorry. Yeah, right. I, I'm definitely not gonna... Wowie, you're so lucky. You get to go home soon. Home? Back there, I was just like you were, Dogen. Punished by my own family for having powers I never asked for. But here, she likes him. I have a chance to be something, to make a difference. They may come for me, Dogen, but they'll be looking for Raz, the boy. What they're going to find is Raz. What they don't expect the boy is Raz, the psychonaut. And 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 then you'll make their heads explode? No. Do you do that? No. Well, once kinda, but. Now I wear this special hat. Yeah. Try it on? No, no, no. But he has mental defenses like I've never seen in someone so young. If I could just get him in my lab for some experiments, I'm sure he could withstand more than the others. That kid's one in a million, Nine. But I'm not gonna let you turn him into one of your guinea pigs. He just said some things on, that were on a pamphlet. Plans for that mind. He just said some that was on a plan pamphlet. And you were like... He is gifted, boy. So, um, do I want it over the friend to the Russian kid? I, uh, oh, this bunk belongs to Roz. Yeah, Roz, I named that my man, so it is. Roz, I am Roz, man. I am Roz, the psychonaut. I will, or, or I will be soon. All right, settle down in here. Big day tomorrow. I want to see each and every one of you runs in my classroom at 0600 hours on the dot. I'm the early bird, and you're the worms. Got it? Now, lights out. It's a dream. Okay, quick eye exam before we start. Huh? Huh? Look over that way if you will. Wow, what's that? Oh, that's a side challenge marker. The staff scatters these all over the camp to test the students. Every one of these you find advances you a whole rank. Uh-huh. Now look up for me if you will. Hmm. Some of the old markers have fallen apart. You'll find bits of them flapping around loose. If you find enough of these star cards, you can put them together to make a brand new challenge marker. But you have to buy a psi core at the camp store to hold them together. Keep ranking up and before you know it, you'll be able to use brand new psychic powers. Stuff you didn't even know you could do. And then when do I become a psychonaut? Because I have to do that before my dad shows up to take me home. Hey, where'd he go? <gasps> he teleported! That guy looks so familiar. Uh, okay, whatever, bye. We he to the whispering wood. Hey, Raz, hurry up! You don't want to be late for basic braining! Woohoo! Basic braining is the best class ever! Woohoo! I heard this. You 
can't. One time, a kid was late for basic braiding, and Coach Oleander held him upside down until he turned blue. But the kid had just drank a six pack of soda, and so when the coach shook him up, he exploded. Oh. Oh. Yeah, food, Alright, I'm gonna get another side card. Pull up an arrowhead. My first arrowhead. Arrowheads are made of uh, mineral titanium, which makes them very valuable, whatever. I'm gonna talk to Dolan. I'm telling you for the last time, no! I would never do that. I could never kill everyone. Oh, I res. Squirrel trouble? They're liars at all. Whatever they tell you, it's a lie. I'll take your word for it. You going to class? Yeah, I'll meet you up there. Does he have so purple hair or red hair? Just shut up. Like hazelnut or something? Yay, they're gone. And they're dead. Yeah, pretty bird. You, new boy, seen bear lurking in woods? Nope. Positive. Giant, hairless bear? Uh, nope. In Russia, bears much smaller, also more hairy, less lurking, always eager to wrestle. This one, hide and run. I'll let you know if I see him. Cannot lurk. Giant, bear. hairless, cowardly bear. Got it. Being in the galaxy, Polaris Australia. Alright. And by worse, did you possibly mean the best? You know that cabin is empty, right? Duh. I'm practicing for tonight when it's gonna be full of ladies. That kind of thing takes practice? Um, excuse me, but my parents let me watch R-rated movies, so I think I know a little bit more about this than you do, okay? Maybe you shouldn't watch R-rated movies. The Whispering Rockers. Oh, uh, what? That's my band name idea. Why aren't you guys in Coach Oleander's class? Are you kidding? A kid got killed in that class last year. I heard it was a bunch of kids, Phoebe. Well, I heard it was a bunch of blind kids, and the coach threw them off a cliff. Yeah, because they were late for class. You'd better hurry, kid. Now, where were we? Well, playing? I'm not blind. Hey, how's everybody tonight? Stupid lady. You feeling people. itchy? I said you feeling itchy. Who's saying that? I don't know. Uh, so, oh yeah, there's. This isn't the boy kid. So, you're dating Elka now. Does that mean we won't hang out as much? Shoot, I reckon things ain't gonna change one bit. Doggone it, partner. No woman's never gonna... Hey, you're gonna make my boyfriend late for class. Come on, James. Come. On. Yeah, this game has voice acting and it's spectacular. So, yeah, I'm gonna head to Coach Oleander's place. So, yeah, this is stuff. Psych challenge markers. Scavenger hunting thing. This That's what this guy gives. His, his name is Ford. Pedro. This is what we're doing. C complete Coach Oleander's obstacle course. And this is... The next place you should go is marked with a this. And this is me. And so, yeah. Hey, 
Hey, where are you going, Maloof? Shh, I snuck out. That class is a death trap for crazy people. Listen, the coach is strong. At the start of class, he pulls you into his mind, and then there's nothing you can do about it. But once you're in, you can use these smelling salts to sneak out. Take mine. I don't need them anymore. I'm calling my parents to come get me before I get hurt. All right, so Too after... Too late! Mommy! Ah! Hey, kid! You owe me five arrowheads for this week's protection service. Cough it up, my loser, or you'll be coughing up bloody tears. Hey, leave him alone. I heard a rumor that you were raised in the circus. Well, let me put this in terms you'll understand. I'm the strong man around here. Really? Because you look more like the cotton candy. <laughs> Betty, put this kid's death on my to-do list. Come on. He has gingivitis. Yeah. We'll settle this on the He has green gums. Green gums cannot be good for you. So, um, yeah. Huh? Yeah. So, um, yeah, that's Bobby. There's Maloof. So, um, last time I got stuck because I didn't know how to, like, use items and stuff. And I still don't because it told me the brackets were. Why don't you take a picture? It'll last longer. Whoops. Sorry. So I... Hey, Chloe. What are you doing? The coach uses this to broadcast his thoughts across the camp. I think I can turn it to reach my people in space. Good luck with that. Coach Oleander, I'm reporting for basic braining. Son, do you realize that to take my course, I will have to pull you into my mind? You will have to relive every bullet-scarred memory of every battle I have ever faced. It would be pretty. Are you sure you wouldn't rather run around a bit more in the sunshine first? I'm ready, sir. Well then... You're yeah, late, and then soldier. it's kind of funny. Now get here and give me 20. Zoom, I still get to suck in. So, this is it. The mental world. It looks like a dentist office. A mental dentist office. It's a recruiting office, kids. And I'm here to recruit you for the greatest job in the world. Being a psychonaut. It's about fighting a war for mental freedom. Are you ready to face torture, insanity, and death? Because this is your last chance to chicken out. Oh, me, sir. I'd like to chicken out, please. Too late, soldier. But you said... There's only one way out of here. Fighting. I want one of you chickens to sock me square in a jaw. I warn you, once you do, the war is on. Yeah. Ah, that's what I'm talking about. Charge! Boom. <laughs> he just exploded him. What kind of obstacle course is this? That kid just got killed. A mental obstacle course, you bleeding heart. He's not dead. His astral projection just got kicked out of my mind. And I'll kick your astral projection out of here too if you don't get moving right yeah. now. Yeah, you know, that's not like super appropriate. Don't watch this if you don't want to hear stuff like that. Just a figment of 
my imagination. You can run right through, figments. They help you rank up, and when you rank up, you earn new psychic powers. So whenever you see a figment, suck it up, soldier! Come on, I'm just that figment! Be a figgy piggy! This is hey, some emotional baggage. What are you baggage. staring at? We all have emotional baggage, kid. Why don't you make yourself useful? Sort some of it out while you're in here. Keep your eyes peeled for a tag that matches. Could be anywhere. <laughs> Onward and upward, soldier! There it is! Now, you will pick up that tag and you will put it on that bag you just found! Unless you'd rather just drop and give me 20 right now! Yay! I'm pretty sure they all have, like, unique animations, at least for the different types of bags. Well, I mean, the different shapes. Not exactly the, all dead. of the different kinds. Because I don't know if they would keep hard, themselves. Son. Show it who's boss. Each figment is worth three figments. For some reason. Yep. Less waiting, more motivating! But I Watch still end out. up with 40. Fire down below. Ow. Oh, ow. I fell instead of climbing back. We can't get past this. This is stupid. Hmm. Looks like a test. There's probably a secret more advanced route. What's that supposed to mean? You think you're more advanced than me, new kid? Sorry, what? I'm not stupid. You're stupid. The coach is stupid. The whole camp is stupid. That thing flying at you is stupid. What's flying at me? <laughs> <laughs> Bobby Zilch's foot! That's what! You stupid new kid! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> thanks for saving me. Well, actually, I was saving this plant. <laughs> Never yeah, seen right. one so meaty before. I have. It's been appearing in this creepy nightmare I keep having. You're having nightmares? Oh, I've been reading about how to fix those. Will you let me see one? Hmm. No. No. Mentalis Uber Alice! Come on, one night. Nope. I don't know if I want to see a nightmare. With weird meaty plants. Also, why are there like figments of cleavers? I mean, I know why, because I've seen footage of this game played. I've watched it to the very end. But, like, that's kind of a hint of what's to come. And those meaty plants, too. I mean, I don't know, I don't remember exactly why they show up. But I know that, that it comes up later. I'm not gonna spoil it for you, though. Until we get there. Then I'll spoil it for you, because... If you're watching this, you don't care about Onward and upward, soldier! Is your name Joey? No. Cause I'm gonna Why call you just... Flowy Joey. That is not my name. Flo what was Flo that, Flowy? I can't hear ya, you're talking too slow. <laughs> Onward and upward, soldier! Onward does not always mean upward. Waiting 
need more motor than that kind of wall. You can climb it up, yeah. down, sideways, whatever way you want. Just get on it. Quick, like a monkey. Hey, slow down. Uh, he just blew up, cause he just, you know, why? Why do they just blow up randomly? Why do they spontaneously come to us? Blow you up like a ten cent kazoo. Hey, Dogan, what's wrong? I keep blowing up. Follow me. I'll help you through the mines. Okay. Just gonna wait for Dogen. So he decides to just run into the mines every now and then. So you have to talk to him. I can't do it. I yes, you can, Dogen. Just follow me. Okay. Just weave through them like a graceful monkey. I can't do it. I follow me. I'll help you through the mines. Okay. Oh, don't just walk into them. Look, Raz. I didn't explore at all. Good hustle, Raz. Hey, first try. This is for helping me out. Okay, bye. This is a psychic arrow. Yep, 
Hello. stops at the end so now I can collect this run bunny don't run cuz I just it's been deactivated Are there any controls in here? Nope. So, apparently brackets isn't working. I don't need it right now. You can grab poles like that and swing on them. It's all about upper body strength, you know?
Um, I'm trying to get over to this. Yep. Amazing. when I get this right. I really need to swing there. twice. right before the end. Alright, let's cut to when I make it. Mm, made it. Hello? Hello? Guess I'm early. Mm. What's this? Something he has to hide? Why wasn't this in his vault? Hold it right there, son. Now, just what in the Sam Hill do you think you're doing in there? I was just looking for a way out. Oh, 
Sorry about that. Didn't think you'd get to the end so fast. Dang, I didn't think you'd get to the end at all. You surprised me out there, kid. Here, you've earned this. Your first Psychonaut Merit Badge. Basic braining. He just kicks. But I'm always glad to see a soldier come back from the field alive. Now, if you'll excuse me, I gotta go back in. I left some good men back there. Uh, I twitching. He's crazy. Am I still dying? Way to make us look bad in there. You are in trouble now. Bobby Zilch ain't happy. You better watch yourself, Goggleicious. What's that, hair boy? You want a piece of me? Hey, Brainiacs, settle down. Why? You worried I'm gonna hurt your boyfriend? No, because Sasha Nine is standing right behind you. Ah. Uh. Your performance, young cadet, was outstanding. <coughs> Thank you to report to my lab for some advanced training. Raz the Spaz is gonna be in a special class. Benny, remind me to give him a special beating later, okay? These tests are unauthorized, though, so I can't actually ask you to come. But if you happen to drop in, well, what could I do? Let me just give you this. Remember, your talent will always set you apart, Rasputin. Sometimes isolation is a good thing. It can lead to important discoveries. Wait! I don't even know what your lab is! Is this some kind of test? Sometimes isolation is a good thing. It can lead to important discoveries. And now I'm hearing things. Great. Mm, amazing. All right. All right, I'm gonna need to explore my buttons. This is the button that Sasha gave me. It's a clue to the location of his secret lab. In this top bubble. Or press one to see what's in here. To pull out an item from your backpack, point to it with uh, your keys and then press space. One and two switch between that. I don't want to crack open these smelling salts unless I'm in a mental world. And I really want to get out. They smell pretty bad. Alright. So now I know how to access my inventory. <coughs> no passing. But I need to get to Sasha 9's secret lab. Maybe you should have thought of that before. I did pick one. Yep. Sorry for skipping this. It basically goes, give me arrowheads if you want to pass. And so he gives them an arrowhead. Whoa there, you. Come here, you. Can't do the skip. He gives me this. So Sorry for skipping I... it. And he's hey, gone. where'd he go? That was, that was Ford, that the guy in the dream. So fast? <coughs> he's still looking for a bear. Hey, you guys are good. Thanks, man. Hey, do you have a lighter? Because if you lit it and held it up right now, that would be rad. And completely insensitive to me and my issues. Oh, right, right. 
Oh, never mind. I forgot about the whole fire bad thing for a moment. No, 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 no. Drum solo! Woo! You heard the man. Sorry, sorry. Hey, what's the name of the band? The, the Fire Starters. Levitators, just fire well, let's starters. Let's not fight in front of the fans, okay? Let's not. Not to worry, my bro. Well, let's just pick it up from the part where I do that thing. <laughs> All right. Forward is selling stuff that I can't afford right now. What you doing there? We're making friendship bracelets. You know, for our friends. Oh, that's not where I want to go. Alright. So yeah, we want to go down this way. Hey, it's the king of the obstacle course! Hey, Raz! You're awesome! You must be a psychonaut by now! Yeah! Or even a double psychonaut! <laughs> oh no, not yet. Yeah, what they face you? toward him. So I'm supposed to be, like, down there? Wow, those two are so nice. So, um... Yeah, I just stand. I'm just standing right there. Look at them. They pour a poison. Ah, they're evil. So yeah, I'm supposed to go down here. Hey, you're that new kid, ain't you? Well, I'm doing some advanced training right now, as a matter of fact. So I don't think new kid is really a name that you want to get too used to saying. Hold on here. You're not doing Sasha Nine's advanced training that he does in his secret underground lab, are you? Hidden deep within the iron walls of the GPC, where no one can hear you screaming? Why, yes I am. Sakes alive. Well, nice knowing you. Nice knowing you too. So I try to go in there. And then add cutscene plays. Hey, was that you? Looking at me? Maybe you should try getting over yourself? There were a lot of other people on that stage besides you. No, just now. In the woods. Hmm, <laughs> no. It must have been something else. You don't smell like pond scum. Nice. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there. Lurking. Watching. I know of only one creature who fits that description. It likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. Really? Who? You, tree sitter! <laughs> yeah, ha ha ha, funny. Yep. Hey, Elka. Hey, butt out. I'm Heidi. And I thought... Oh, no. When will you peek into the hole in my heart? Because you just see yourself staring back. Uh-huh. What? I mean, he'd see my new boyfriend, James, staring back. Wah, baby, go cry. He's in here. This way. Bam! Told you. Because I, I knew. Thanks. I thought I was gonna have to eat my own arm. What is this thing? It's a GPC, a geodesic psychoisolation chamber. Oh man, cool. Cool? Do you have any idea what this does? Something uh, cool? Uh, no. It's a six sensory deprivation tank, a hermetically sealed metaphysical hot box. It's solitary confinement for psychics. Nasty. Uh. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah, the staff hasn't put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Boolean dwarf accomplice should assault own size or larger only. Wild and cooler. Perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. 
Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. Hey, wait! And they develop a friendship. I'm gonna actually get to the point where I stop playing. On sale now in the main store, we have a special on Dream Fluffs. You hear me? Dream Fluffs! They're good for you. Keep a pocket full of these for so, a uh, mental health. You do this. Looks like one of the buttons is missing. Hmm, whatever shall I do? Agent 9, I'm here for the advanced training. It's dark. Ooh. So what are we going to learn? Bending spoons? Burning stuff? I've been hearing a lot about head explosion, and I was wondering... Science, Rasputin. That is what we practice down here, not parlor tricks. If you are serious about exploring the possibilities of your mind, step up to the brain tumbler and we'll begin. Brain tumbler? Have you tested this thing out on humans yet? Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. That doesn't answer my question. But I'm not ready, not just yet. It sounds like vocals, like boing, bang, except really high pitched and, and like yep. edited. Yep. Yep. Well, I mean. Hey, you guys sound great. <laughs> Much obliged, partner. <coughs> I don't know. Maybe I just want to do it. Ah, look. Arrowheads. I can finally make a single side challenge marker. Maybe I should go do that real quick. Oh, a gold coin. Oh, it's a scavenger hunt thing. All right, let's do this. Excuse me. He's talking about. Oh, that's my last stuff. Count with that now. You take that side car there, put it together I'll with nine. It. Excellent choice. What else can I do you for? Now, you take that that's side car now. there. Huh? Alright, go get more airheads and come on back. Support your local. Hey, where's my hamburger? Ah. Yes, Don't put. Now, you take that side car there, put it together with nine side cards. And you'll have yourself a brand new side challenge marker. Now that that's it for now. Rod will help. All right, so uh, do I do this? hey, anything new in the store? Take a look. Now that down now. It, mm, whoa, that man was that high. Now here's something every young side cadet needs. Now was that now? You take that side car there. That's it for now. All right, go get more air. Hey, why are you stopping? Well, I have Come enough to make market. one. I guess. Uh. Let's go back.
right, we're back. I hey, Elka. Why don't you and your little goggles go poke around in someone else's private business? Alright. Let's do this. Brain me. Is that the cleaning lady? I'll get those files out of your way just as... Could you try it first? Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. So, what's this hairdryer thing do? Ah, you're ready for the brain tumbler. With this device, we will send you deep into your own psyche, where you should find unparalleled insight and power. Excellent! Tumble away. Now just relax. This will not hurt. Unless something really very bad happens. Alright, here we go. Inside our inner psyche. Wow. Is this what the inside this is of is like my mind a level looks like? Not yet. It's You're like still traveling to the astral a plane. Level this is a select tiny corner thing. of what we call the collective unconscious, a place in which all of our unconscious minds are connected. You have just begun your training, Rasputin, so many of the connections with other minds are still not developed for you, and those doorways remain just out of reach. But the more you explore the mental world, the more connections you will form. Right now, the only unconscious world you can enter is that one. Your own. Step through it, and we'll I continue. I mean, didn't I go into Oleanders? <laughs> so, yeah. This is that place, like he told you. This is mine. My head, I guess. It's called Brain Tumbler Experiment, though. Rasputin, can you hear me? Sasha? Where am I? You are inside your own mind, but I'm not sure where. Tell me, what can you see? I see <coughs> a run-down gypsy caravan. Do you recognize it? Yes. It's where I was born. I see. Compelling. Hmm. Interesting. Get over here. There we go. Rasputin's get away. He is in the circus. And then he's like, here's a pamphlet. Mm. And while um, doing weights, I guess, he's looking at that pamphlet and he's like, whoa. And his dad is like, no. And he's sad. So he's like, mm, nah. So he leaves on his dog. No, that's a pig. That's a pig. He leaves on his pig. And he's there. Bam. That's how he came here. Sasha. And going inside the caravan. What do you see inside? Static. Uh oh. What? No, I'll figure it out. Aha! Egg! Rasputin, are you okay? What do you see now? I see a small, bunny like animal thing. Hmm. An unfamiliar animal entity in a dream often represents a primal fear or memory. Follow it and it should lead you somewhere important. Check. Okay, Mr. Bun. You and I are gonna be tight. Wherever you go, I go. Like two peas in a... Hey! Come back here! Why does it have hearts all over it? Unfamiliar animal entity. Funny. Yep. Ooh! It's a tag. 
Okay. Oh. Uh, Sasha? What is it? Another bunny? No. This is more of a super scary flaming eyed demon kind of deal. Oh. Hmm. What? Okay, I'm pulling you out of there. Just give me a second. Uh, Sasha? Hold on, I'm still getting some unusual interference. It's fascinating. As if someone else... Agent 9? Sorry. Almost ready. Sasha! As if someone else what? Hmm? <laughs> hmm. That should not have happened. We need to try that again. Oh. I don't think I need to be in the tumbler with the glowy eye guys anymore. Suit yourself. You know, in many tribal societies, learning to defeat the monsters you see in your dreams is considered a rite of passage. I can train you to fight. Come see me when you're ready. Uh... Sure. Okay, I'm ready to learn how to really fight. Oh, really? Hmm. What? Uh, nothing. It's just that I didn't think you'd really take me up on that offer. It usually scares the kids off. Well, not me. I'm ready to kill for my camp. Listen, I'm sorry, but I can't train you. Agent Vodello would kill me. What's the big deal? What she doesn't know won't hurt her. You don't even have a marksmanship learner's permit. I could lose my job. I'll get one. Even if you used that secret passage over there and snuck into his sanctuary, Agent Cruller would never give you a marksmanship learner's permit. Agent Cruller? Never in a million... I'm off. Be right back after I talk with Agent Cruller. Secret passage. <gasps> hey! Welcome to the Whispering Rocket Underground Rapid Transit System. Would you like to go back to your private sanctuary now, Agent Cruller? Or somewhere else? Let's oh, go to Ford's, Ford. I mean, my sanctuary. The, uh, Ford Crawler, yes, huh? Yes, Psycho Master. Okay. Ford is, like, the best psychonaut out there, I guess. Crawler, give me a marksman badge. Or right, Ford. Hmm, you finally made it. He it's was an honor to finally meet you in person, sir. I thought I recognized you in my dream, but I couldn't be sure. Now that I see you in your element, there's no doubt. You're yeah. Ford Cruller, the greatest leader the Psychonauts ever had. Well, you shouldn't believe everything you read in True Psychic Tales magazine. here at Whispering Rock. This trading facility is built right smack on top of the largest titanium deposit known to man. It runs under this whole valley and makes this a very critical area for the Psychonauts. So I'm here to look after it and to make sure you little spoonbenders don't kill each other. I saw you raking leaves. Was that a disguise? Uh, yes. Well, well, I have many disguises. It, it helps me keep an eye on you kids wherever you go. <laughs> now, <clears throat> when I'm in disguise, I may pretend not to recognize you. Don't blow my cover, okay? Say no more. Your secret identity is safe with me. What's Citanium? Citanium is a very rare psychoreactive mineral that crashed here on a meteorite hundreds of years ago. It responds to psychic waves, focuses them, amplifies them. It can make psychics more psychic, but it can also make unstable people more unstable. Not everyone can handle that much activity in that part of their brain. It can drive them completely out of their gourd. Gives this valley an interesting history. Hmm? I, need to learn I don't know how to redeem it. You to teach I feel like I could redeem it from him. Yeah. I had a vision with a huge monster with yellow eyes and a big mouthful of gnashing teeth. Did it happen to spit anything at you? Yeah. I think it was like an old dining helmet or something. I see. Hmm. Yes, well, we'd better get you armed. Why? What's happening? Nothing, nothing. Prepare your mind. 
That's the motto of the Psychonauts. Here, this is a marksmanship learner's permit. It will only work when you're in Sash's mind. Once you complete his shooting range, you'll get the real merit badge and you can Psyblast anywhere you want. Thanks. Psyblast? No, you'll find out. Now get going. We can't have the camp overrun with big-eyed garbage spitting monsters, can we? No, sir. I'd better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Thanks. I'll need it. Don't worry. I'll be right here with you. Inside your head. My head? Yep. I want to keep my eye on you, son, so I'm going to be a psychic stowaway inside your noggin. If you ever want to make me appear, you can do it with this special device. Bacon. Is that a piece of bacon? Oh, yeah. I just love bacon. I smell that stuff and I can't help it. I drop everything and come running. Okay. Do you bacon. have like a little baggie or something I could put this in? You get a move on or I'll eat that right here. Now don't go pulling that out when I'm physically nearby. Now don't go pulling that out when I'm physically nearby. Or I'm telling you, I'm going to eat it. Alright, so, um, I think we'll stop there. Um, alright, yeah. So, that was Psychonauts. And, um, if you're new here, don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy these videos. And I'll see you next time. Bye!